To start taking card payments in WooCommerce, do the following. Make sure you're logged into WordPress and make sure WooCommerce is installed. Then on the side, click on Plugins, then choose Add New Plugin, and then just search for Stripe. And then click on Install on this plugin here, and then choose to activate. Then on the side, go to WooCommerce, click on Settings, then click on Payments, and you should see that you have this option here, Stripe. Click on Complete Setup and then click on create or connect an account here. Put an email address in to sign up, or if you already have an email address, use it to sign in and it'll connect to WooCommerce. Once you've connected to Stripe, you should see that, for example, payments enabled here. If, for example, payouts disabled like it is here, you just need to add some more information in Stripe. So you can go into Stripe by going to uh, stripe.com and you can basically log in and go to this dashboard and you can enter more information in here and you can also organize to be paid out to your bank account and all sorts of other things in here. If we go back into WordPress and we click on configure connection and then we click on test, we'll set up a test connection so you can take test payments on the store and try things out. So we'll click on here at the bottom, create, create or connect a test account. I'll choose to connect to here. And one thing it does is it connects the test account so you can start taking test payments. And another thing it's done is it's ticked test mode here. And when test mode's ticked here, you'll only take test payments on your website. So when you want to start taking live payments, you'll want to untick this box. But when you've done all your changes, click save. And one thing to note is you can change other settings below of how things will appear on a bank statement and other settings. Here I'll show you an example of where you can test out payment. So test mode's enabled, you can see because it says it here. And you can copy this card number and you can paste it in here. And then when you're ready to buy the product, you can place the order and you can see you get a confirmation there.